Hey people. Okay. Um how's everybody? <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna show you guys a super quick money spell. This actually just came to me. The spirit was like, this is what I want. And I know people are like, oh, you post all these different ways to go like, spend money or whatever, but sometimes this not sometimes. Most of the time, the spirits will tell you what it is that they want. What, you know, they, they want things. They want offerings. They want fruit or food or wine or whatever. They, hey, Luna. God, the infamous cat. Anyway, the spirit will tell you what it is that they are asking for, what they need from you on this side in order to manifest what you want from their side to here. So... The spirit was like, this is what I want. So I'm going to show you guys. As you can see, I have a Granny Smith apple. Oh, they are so good, too. I have Hoyt's cologne, um, H-O-Y-T-S, Hoyt's cologne. If you guys are not familiar with this, Hoyt's cologne is a cologne that is known or used by gamblers. It's kind of a lucky hand wash. People wash their hands in it before they play the lotto or play poker or go to the casino or things of that nature. Um, it's a very good money drawing hand wash and I usually cleanse my candles in Florida water but as you just saw I wanted to use the Hoyt's cologne. So. The next thing you're going to need is some whole allspice. Um, if you have the powder, that's fine. I like the whole better because it's easier. You can just drop it in there, but whichever one will work perfectly well. You will need some money drawing oil. This money drawing oil, I actually blend it myself, but any money drawing oil that you prefer, you can use. I just want to pour a little bit in there. Not too much, but just a little bit. Like they say, a little bit goes a long way. I also have some cinnamon. Um, I have the whole cinnamon, and again, if you only have powder, that's fine. I work with both, but today I decided to put a little whole piece of cinnamon. All that's going to go down into the, the hole that I've carved. As you can see, I've made a hole, carved off the middle. And the idea of this is this apple is going to be your candle holder. Okay, so... I've cleansed the candle in my Hoyt's cologne, I've put in my allspice, I've put in my money drawing oil, I've put in my cinnamon, I'm going to write my intent on the candle, and this can be a denomination of money, if it's a bill that you need paid, if it's um, just bringing money into the household, um, bringing money to the business, or etc. But for the sake of the video... Um, we're going to say, we all have utility expenses, so we're going to say light bill. And this can, like I said, this can be anything. Light bill, gas bill, um, someone owes you some money, whatever you want. So that's been written on the candle, inscribed, I should say. And I like to add a little bit of money. If you guys have a, um, you know, a dime or a quarter or some denomination that can fit down inside of the circumference, that's very good. And I'm going to take some of my money oil and anoint my candle going in an upright motion. As we're drawing in the money, we're bringing it to us. We're thinking, bringing in the money. Show me the money. And you pop your little candle down in there, and voila. Also, on a side note, I didn't add this, but I do use it. These little, little babies come from, um, I'm tired. Come from Planet, not Planet Fitness, Party City. <laughs> Party City, the little confetti money, the little dollar signs or whatnot. When you're doing spells, you always want to incorporate signs and symbols that represent what you're trying to manifest. So this little little mama right here, I'm just going to pop that in there. If you don't have it, it's okay. 
if you can get it, awesome. If you had a dollar bill, you could stick it on the side. You can really do whatever you want. Now, just a disclaimer, you need to watch this because as this burns down, this can catch on fire. I don't want anyone having a problem and saying, well, Mystic, you didn't tell us. I mean, common sense, but this can catch on fire. So you don't have to put that in there, but the more the merrier. This is your money drawing spell. This is for the light bill, which is what I wrote on it, but heck, whatever you want it to be. And I'm going to give this as an, al an offering on my ancestor altar. I'm going to light it. I'm going to let it burn down completely. I'm not going to put it out. Um, you can also bake the apple. You can like do a whole baking of the apple and then put the candle in as a ritual. That's an option. Um, it's like, I don't know what time it is in the morning, so I didn't want to bake it. But you can do that as well. Okay, questions, comments, leave them below. Love you, love you. Talk to you guys soon.